Hello everybody, this is my second time filming this because my camera ran out of storage for whatever reason because I haven't even filmed anything for the longest time, but hello, welcome to my channel. Like I said, it's been a very long time since I picked up this camera. A few little updates, I actually just launched my very own jewelry business it's obviously a small business but um i started it all from scratch by myself i made a website for it and it just launched on monday so i'm gonna leave the url at the bottom in the description so you guys can go check it out everything is very affordable and on trend so Hope you guys will go check it out like i said it has been a while since i picked up the camera and i don't know why i just like have this like motivation to film right now um i'm probably gonna do like a daily vlog for today because i have a few things to do and i thought i would bring you guys along with me it is currently 10 30 and i have a class at 11 to 12 15 and then i also have a nail appointment and a meeting later on tonight but i thought i would show you guys what i do in a day as you can see i literally just woke up so let's go make some breakfast before i have to get on my class Okay, I just finished my smoothie and I have class in literally five minutes, so I'm gonna make my coffee super quick. This is all the stuff I use, it's really not that much. It's the Trader Joe's Joe coffee, the most basic you can get. And then this is the coffee creamer I use. It's a so delicious coconut creamer. It's so good. So I'm going to make that really fast. Hello, everybody. It's been several hours from when I last... The lighting is so bad. From when I last came on here because I've been doing homework for literally the past three hours so i'm done with my one class for the day and now i've just been in my room doing homework and this is my setup right now i literally need a bigger desk because of how cluttered it gets and i get like really bad anxiety when I have like a cluttered mess which is what my room is like right now but I have this candle I don't know why it's like this but I have this candle burning it smells amazing and it reminds me of this is like such like a weird like thing but it reminds me of like the beginning of quarantine like when we shut down in March and there's still like snow on the ground and it was still cold and everything like that I don't know why I think I maybe because I burnt it like at that time last year I don't know but the lips are really bad right now because of my medicine but 
I am working on stats right now and I'm like the worst ever at math. Like I literally go on Khan Academy for like everything because of like I literally just like don't understand. Like I think of me as like a smart person but when it comes to math it's just like I just don't understand. So Khan Academy shout out to you. I'm gonna finish my homework and then I'm gonna get ready to go get my nails done. Okay. That's my axis. Let me draw my bell curve. Let me draw the bell curve. Hello, I'm back and just wanna show you guys how I'm packaging my shipments for um, my little business. So I have obviously the piece of jewelry and then I have like a little thank you note and then I just like wrote a little note with it and it's coming like that in a packaging. I have like all the information on like my computer so it's like super easy and I thought it'd be a lot harder than it is but like it's so organized and this makes me really happy that people are supporting me. So I'm going to package the orders that I have for today and ship them out. Um, so yeah. Hello, it's been several, no it hasn't. It's been like maybe an hour. I just packaged everything up. I'm going to take it to the shipping place, the mailing place and ship them. They're my first orders and I'm so excited. Um, I'm going to get my nails done right now. They're so hideous, so that needs to be fixed. Thought I would show you the fit. Sorry, my room is a literal mess. I've been doing like the most random stuff all morning, so it's gonna be fixed when I get back, don't worry. For my zip up, this is from Aritzia, and it's just like this gray, zip up nothing too special uh lululemon aligned leggings these are my black yeezys and a little self-promotion this necklace is from my first launch so check it out <laughs> but i will talk to you guys after i get my nails done hello i just walked in my house from getting my nails done I didn't really get them done. I did, but I didn't because I got clear dip and that is for the sole reason of like having my nails clear for like so long. I'm like so used to it and I love just like the clear look right now. I don't know what it is. It just like feels very clean. So that's what I got. That's what they look like. They look really good actually. I wish my nails were a little bit longer but each nail was like such different sizes that it just like makes sense to like do them all a shorter length. So we're super happy with it. Right Meg? <laughs> She's like staring at the camera but I'm about to um package all of my packages up right there and put stamps on them and bring them to the post office so i can send them out today and yeah don't have much to do today so we're just chilling for the rest of the day and i'm gonna hang out with jacob later that's it hello it's currently two days later from when I last vlogged, but I am currently looking back at old videos that, <laughs> oh my god, that's an awful, that's an awful photo of me, but it's, it's okay. Um, I'm looking at old videos and it's just like making me want to like really really get back into it like genuinely I just like have the motivation 
to like really get into it and like build my following and I just launched my website I want to get more into like building my followers because that's like basically you know what I'm going to school for so let's try this um I'm gonna make it a priority of mine to just like really get back into it it's harder for me to do it at school because I have roommates and I just don't want to like invade their space in any way um if I'm like filming and stuff but yeah just so I just needed to tell somebody that because I'm alone in my room so I got these blue light glasses and I don't really know how I feel about them I feel like they're kind of ugly but at the same time like they can be cute uh tomorrow i'll show you guys um the stuff i got uh from nordstrom nordstrom rack was having a, like a really really big sale and one of the things i got was this blanket that my dog is laying on it's a barefoot dreams blanket and they're usually 108 dollars and i got it for 49 dollars and then, like, after I saw that, it was, like, an Instagram ad. I just, like, kept on shopping. So, I got these glasses, and I got three more things. So, I'll show you guys that tomorrow. But, yeah, I just wanted to pop on here and say that. I'm currently looking at internships. I'm applying to a few of them. I'm trying to decide if... I want to do an internship this year or this summer or I just want to like take this summer to like really focus on like my website, social media, that kind of stuff because like I said, I'm really motivated. I want, I know I can do it. I just like have to put my mind towards it and even I want to say two summers ago, I was like religiously doing youtube like every single week multiple times a week always vlogging and yeah i'm rambling and you guys probably don't care but yeah this is my current state right now i'm in this aritzia um sweatsuit and this crew is a boyfriend crew no the oversized cozy AF crew that my boyfriend got me. I love it. And then these pants, if you can tell, they are, I want to say these are the boyfriend sweatpants, but they're literally huge on me. So I'll show you. They're like literally flooding on me. And then if you look at the back, <laughs> oh my. I literally never realized Jacob literally said like your butt looks so weird and I like didn't really think about it until I just looked in the mirror so that's my current state right now I totally not totally I just like literally switched around my bed and my desk and I don't know I just like like it so much better I feel very cozy in that like little pod back there so this is my room right now and over here is a little bit messy. That's the stuff I got from Nordstrom Rack that I'll show you guys. But I I don't know. I like this area, but at the same time, it's like a little it's a little cluttered. Just with like school and everything going on, my like schoolwork and also my business is just like I'm acting like my business is like something huge. It's really not. It's like the tiniest thing ever, but it's going to get there. I'm manifesting it for myself and it's going to happen. So I have a few things I have to do tomorrow. I have my executive board training this entire weekend, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. It like, it's basically all day besides tomorrow. It starts at 7 p.m. Um, because it's Friday, but I have... A lot of things to do because I have the executive board training all weekend and then I'm going back to school moving all my stuff back um, 
on Monday. So I literally have no time to do anything. So tomorrow I'm taking that time to just like get what I have to get at the store, food, whatever it is. Um, I have to go get hangers. I want to go to Ikea to um, get a new comforter, which I'll obviously take you guys along with me. This will probably end up being a week vlog because I vlogged like two days ago and I never finished it. I ended up going to the post office and taking all my first shipments to ship. That was super exciting for me. I took photos because I was so excited. <laughs> but besides the point, tomorrow I have a lot of things to do. I'm going to bring you guys along with me and... I hope you guys like it, but I will see you guys tomorrow. Oh, so you don't have any home we don't. Yeah, we don't. Everybody. <clears throat> Hello everybody. Um, I just made a green smoothie. I make one of these every single day whether it's for breakfast or lunch. I basically put the same thing in it every single day. It has banana, frozen strawberries, frozen blueberries, a ton of spinach, like two handfuls, um, spirulina, like the tiniest bit of vanilla protein powder because I like the taste. Uh, let's see. And cinnamon. With almond milk um, for like the liquid. And it tastes so good. If you haven't tried cinnamon in your smoothies, it's a literal game changer. You have to do it. It's amazing. So I made this for breakfast and then I'm also having coffee. And then I'll have lunch, obviously, in a few hours. She adds it, not only does it give it a boost of flavor, it also helps with your digestion. Every single time I stop recording, my mom says something about what I should say. So now she says that I should elaborate more on what I put on here and why I put it in here. So. Cinnamon is really good with that digestion. Not only does it taste really good in smoothies, it just helps with digestion. So if you have digestion problems, try incorporating cinnamon into your daily intake. Also, spirulina is really, really good for you. Spirulina is a natural source. It just like comes from like actual algae. Um, so I can't name all the spirulina, be spirulina benefits, but there's so many of them. You can look them up. That's why I have it every single day. And there's really not many benefits for uh, vegan protein powder. Like I said, I just do it for the taste. But of course it has protein, but it's artificial protein, which I really don't like putting a lot. In my smoothies, I literally do like this much in the cup. So that's why I put it in there. Obviously the fruit is like self-explanatory. Fruit is really good for you and you need to have a lot in your day. Is that good for you? <laughs> yeah, it's better. You, yeah, you just kind of, yeah, just be more elaborate and just say, you know, these are the benefits of this, you know. Okay, I just uh, got done drinking my smoothie. I want to show you guys the things that I got from Nordstrom Rack. They're having like a huge sale. And I got probably 
probably like three hundred dollars worth of things for like 160 bucks so one of them was the barefoot dreams blanket i've been wanting one of these for the longest time i feel like all like influencers have them and they rave about them so i finally got my hands on one after it was on sale for $49 amazing deal and then I got this <laughs> people are gonna be like what okay so this is like a trucker hat I've been wanting a trucker hat for a long time and I thought just like this good sport red one was cute and I feel like I don't know I, like the way like I envision it in my head would be cute <laughs> if it's actually gonna be cute I don't know but stay updated and then uh, these are the blue light glasses i got they're not in the case but it's from this brand it's called death and i had them on yesterday this is what they look like i can put them on for you right now i don't know I said you I said you guys yesterday I was like contemplating on them but I think I think they grew on me. I just feel like my head is very round and with these type of glasses I've always thought they would look really bad and in the photos they looked more wider but with my hair down I feel like it looks like kind of cute. So so we're gonna stick with them. I don't know if I mentioned that they're blue light glasses, but they're blue light and I got them for like $18. And they're originally like 70 bucks, so. And they had really good reviews. And then I got, I've been really, really wanting a wristlet. I carry around my like Louis Vuitton card holder everywhere. And I swear every girl on the planet has one. And it's just like so annoying to like have the same thing as everyone. And I just like want to be different. So I was like thinking about purchasing the Fendi card holder. But it's $450, $480 or something. And I just don't want to spend that right now. So I just wanted some type of wristlet. I didn't care the size, I just wanted to wear it around my wrist. For whatever reason, I just don't like crossbodies in the winter time. Like, when I'm wearing a coat, it's just like so uncomfortable. I feel like constricted wearing a crossbody or a purse. So, also, I've been super into colors lately. I've been trying to get out of my like white neutral phase and like actually just experiment and have fun with colors. So, with all being said, I got this wristlet. It's totally not me if you know me, but like I said, I'm trying new things, I'm experimenting, and I just thought the color scheme is like really cute. It's like kind of neutral, like I feel like I could wear this like with like basically everything, and it's really big, but it's not like extremely big. <laughs> so it just has a wrist thing and then I thought it was cool that it has like a pocket for your phone and then I can obviously fit my car keys, trapstick, whatever it is in there and it's just like a really good size to carry around. Lastly, I got this pink tote bag from Steve Madden, which is the brand. I seriously love it. It's the coolest texture Ever. Like, I got a tote originally for, like, a beach pool day bag, and I just think this material is, like, perfect for it. It's, like, plastic, but it's, like, soft and, like, durable, and then it also comes with a wristlet that, like, attaches to the inside as well to, like, put cards in it or just, like, stuff you would need to like stay safe in like a pool or like beach area so this was originally i want to say like 200 dollars, and i got it for 80 maybe no 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 no. i think it let me look okay so 
This is the one that I bought. I was contemplating between the pink and the green, and I'm really glad I got the pink. I got it for $29, and it was originally $88. I don't know why I said $200, but that was the original price, and it was great. So, this wristlet I bought for... $33 as well. Um, I'm not exactly sure how much it was. I'm gonna look up how much it originally was Okay, so well, this was originally $98 and I got it for 33. It came in a few different colors um, But I decided on like the mixed color. I also like the white That's my neutral phase coming in, but I don't know I just wanted something different. I like this one a lot and I'm glad I got it Here's here's what the trucker hat looks on me. I love like the height of it. Like if I was at the beach or something, like this would be a cute hat. <laughs> I don't know. Call me crazy, but I think it's really cute. And it was really cheap. I want to say it was fifteen dollars. So can't go wrong with a good trucker hat. Okay, I'm doing my homework and. I literally, okay, my hair is like so bad. I'm literally taking the coolest class. I'm still in a few prereqs for um, getting into the business school at my school. And one of my classes is this music class. It's like literally just like a elective or whatever. And it's literally all about music from like way back in like the 1900s. And it's like so cool like i'm literally learning about like louis armstrong like all these like really cool back in the day people and i love that type of music i think jazz and the blues and all that kind of stuff is so cool and like li we literally have to watch this video listen to this it's literally just like listening to music It's literally so cool and I love learning about that kind of stuff even though it's not useful to my major whatsoever it's like actually cool to learn about that kind of stuff because I really don't have knowledge about it so anyway I'm gonna go back to doing homework I just thought I would say that because I just really like what I'm learning anyway so I have this to finish and then I also have a math lab to do which I suck at math so it's gonna be great I'm gonna finish this hopefully by 12 it's 10 45 right now so fingers crossed I get that done so I have the rest of the day to do all the other stuff I have to do so I'll keep you guys updated you guys I look like a literal mess but I just I physically and mentally cannot handle math like I don't know what it is it just doesn't like switch in my head but I'm like so frustrated. It's already 12.25 and I want to be done with all my homework by 12. And I'm still on the first question on my math homework. Like we literally have to do a lab for my math. Like what the hell? If anyone is in statistics and can help me out, please text me or DM me. I need help. I am so drained. Like seriously. Oh god, I look so terrible. I haven't even washed my face today because of all the homework I've been doing. So I am gonna go take a shower, get ready for the day, and I really wanna go to Target and also Salvation Army. Like I said, I'm trying to step up my game a little bit. Um, not really game, just like my outfits. Like I want to like incorporate more colors. And I went to Salvation Army a few weeks ago and I literally found so many cute stuff. So much cute stuff. And I'm going to go back, but I don't know if you can hear my stomach rumbling. I'm starving because I've literally been sitting at my desk for the past four hours three hour three or four hours so it's time to get ready for the day and
these glasses need to come off. I'll show you guys my outfit and <laughs> everything when I'm ready. Okay, I'm back and I decided that I'm going to go to the gym. I didn't go yesterday and I went to yoga the day before. But I've just been so busy to the point where like I literally don't even have time to go. And this is like the first day that I like have time to like breathe and I'm not like going like non-stop somewhere. So I'm going to go to the gym. I'm going to get my gym clothes on and then I'll come back, shower, do whatever I just explained. But I'm so excited to go because I haven't gone in feels like forever. So let's go. These are the kind of outfits I wear to the gym every day. I love wearing a colorful <laughs> matching set and I just wear like an oversized sweatshirt with it but I just feel like I work out better when I know like I don't look like super gross if that makes sense. Like if I go in like you know some random leggings and a sweatshirt and I feel gross I look bad but like just going to the gym every day in an outfit that I like love makes me feel good and I do better so this is like what I like to wear this set is from Lululemon this is the long line sports bra and I don't know the exact thing but if you can tell it's like ribbed material and then the leggings are the Align leggings and these are in the 25 inch. And then my sweatshirt is from Aritzia, my favorite kind of sweatshirts and they're perfect to work out in and they don't get like super gross, they don't get gross at all after working out and then I wash them, it's still like super soft love and then my gym shoes i've been wearing these whoa 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 for the past like i want to say four years these are the adidas ultra boost i think i don't know i'm not really a good shoe person i have no idea but these work for me and they're very comfortable. Like I said, I haven't ate anything, so I'm gonna go eat right now. And then I'm gonna go to the gym. So, see you guys soon. I'm on my way to go get my car washed because it's literally so dirty. I got my windows tinted on Monday and you can't wash your car, roll down your windows or anything for three to five days and since it's been like snowing and there's salt on the ground and everything my black car is like so dirty so we're gonna go get a car wash and i'm gonna feel so much better once it's all clean because i hate having my car dirty it literally gives me anxiety which is like the weirdest thing ever but that's just like how I feel so I'm super excited and then I'm going to go ship out a package that someone ordered today which is super exciting so gonna go do those things and I still have homework but I'm trying to think if I have time this weekend to do it um like in between my meetings i just don't know it's literally so frustrating because i just can't handle math and when i don't understand something i get like so mad because i just want to understand it but like i'm literally teaching this stuff myself it's like ridiculous so with all that being said i'm going to the car wash and i'm so excited <laughs> I just dropped off like the package for the like one of like so, like someone bought a pack and bought something from my company or my business and I go in the post office I've never seen this guy in my life he's working like behind the counter 
and there's like two people working so like i went to the, like the the lady that was working because like that was like the free spot he was helping someone and then whatever the chick was like do you need anything else blah blah and um the guy goes hi olivia and i'm like the hell? like i've literally i swear on the bible i've never seen this guy in my entire life and he was working at the post office like i don't even know anyone that works at the post office he was like this middle-aged guy and i was like what in the i'm terrified i have no idea how he knows my name he goes does anyone call you olive and i go no like what I, like really confused like why he knows my name i don't know i'm i'm so paranoid right now so i don't really know what to think i'm about to call my mom <laughs> but i'm on my way to the gym and uh hopefully he doesn't attack me hello i just got home from the gym and i'm actually really proud of myself because the workout i usually do is like super difficult sometimes and a lot of times i'll like rest my hands on the treadmill so i'm not getting that like full-on like active workout um so basically what I do at the gym is I go on the treadmill literally just for 30 minutes. I incline it to 12 of a speed of 3 for 30 minutes. If you're on TikTok, you've probably seen it. But I've been doing that since mid-November and I've lost 20 pounds. So it actually does work. I promise you, if you be consistent with it, it really truly does work and you do see results very fast. Like I said, November, that was like three months ago and I haven't lost that much weight since my eating disorder freshman year and that was in like the worst way possible and I did this like eating fully vegan, good quality good quantity foods so it is possible if you put your mind to it and you do it consistently so that's what I do and like I said I'm really proud of myself because I usually sometimes like put my hands on the treadmill but this time I literally only did it one time in the whole entire 30 minutes and I haven't worked out in a few days so I'm just really proud okay so I'm going to make, not really make, I get this green juice from Trader Joe's, I'll show you when I get inside. And I like drinking that after my workout because it just, it just feels like it cleanses me. Probably actually doesn't, but I feel like it does, so I'm still gonna do it. This is the green juice from Trader Joe's I was talking about, and it's so good. This is what it has in it. It has kale juice, spinach juice, green apple, cucumber, celery, lemon juice, and ginger powder. And there's no added sugars or anything, so it's great. And I used to get this all the time when I was at school, and then I went to Trader Joe's a few days ago, and I picked it up. And I love it for after my workouts, because it makes me feel amazing. Delicioso. So this is my favorite lunch combination ever. I literally already ate my one piece because I was starving. Um, but this is Ezekiel flaxseed bread. And then avocado. And then I use this sauerkraut. I literally do not eat avocado toast without this. It's amazing. If you like pickles, then you'll love this. If you hate it, then you won't like this. But it's so good. So good for you. And it's my favorite lunch. And it doesn't really seem like that much, like two pieces of toast. But it actually fills me up for so long. And I love it. So I definitely recommend. Okay, my mom and I are about to go to Ikea to get some storage stuff um for my apartment because it's a little messy in my room so before i go back to school i told her that's what i wanted to get so just want to show you my outfit real quick this 
So what is this? This uh, <laughs> oversized crew is from Aritzia. It's the Cozy AF. And I, or someone, my mom probably accidentally put it in the dryer. So it's a little short now and I'm upset, but it's okay. And then these leggings are the Lululemon Align leggings, the 28 inches. And I'm wearing my black Yeezys. I recently cut my hair when I was in Florida impulsively. And... I did, well, I didn't really cut my hair. I just, like, cut, like, the bangs or whatever. And I like it because usually when I wear my hair up, I look, like, literally bald. So, this is that. And I'll be back. Hello, guys. I was just on my first, my first of two meetings I have. today and it's still going and it's like froze for like 20 seconds anyway so we have a 15 minute break and i thought i would show you guys what i got at ikea okay so i got pillowcases okay so basically let me just like tell you guys my view of what i want my bedroom to look like i got this um it's a duvet color. Wait, what is this? Oh, yeah. It's a duvet cover and it comes with two pillowcases. And it's this like pink and white striped duvet color cover. And they only had King. And I wanted this really, really badly. And they were sold out online as well. So I got a comforter. So I can put the duvet cover over it. And it's obviously going to be like really big. Oh, hello. It's obviously going to be really big. But I think it will look like cute and cozy if it's like really oversized. So I got that. And then I also got pillowcases which are going to be like... uh, They're like a mute green color. I'll show you a photo of what I want my like bed to look like so here's a photo it's like basically just like a mix of like all these different colors so i got like a little pink and i got green and then i'm also gonna get like a light blue like that and then i obviously already have my white pillows which i am getting new pillows because like i said i got greenish like it's like a blue green type of um color which i'll show you guys after they get out of the wash um but i'm gonna get new pillows because i accidentally got king size pillows so they're huge but like i'm not mad about it because i'll totally go for king size pillows so that's the bed situation which i'll move this over here i also got these organizers which were in like the bath and bathroom area um so basically i got these for my hair accessories um i'm gonna use this bigger one for like my headbands and my big clips and that kind of stuff these two are gonna be for like bobby pins and smaller clips and that kind of stuff because as you can see my drawer or my cabinet is like so unorganized there's like stuff everywhere so i just want things to like be in a container and then this is like totally like not relevant but i saw these and it's like the coolest thing ever so basically you can put it like over stuff instead of like a lid you put it over or instead of like putting it in a plastic bag or whatever it is you can like put it over like an orange peel or like avocado or like really anything and then you just wash it and it's like totally good again which i thought was so cool instead of like saran wrap like using all that plastic so i got those because i just thought they were cool and then lastly i got this plant so this wall of my room oh my god the dog hi bean Anyway, so this side of my room is, like, pretty complete. Um, and then this is this side. 
And then I'm still trying to figure out. I feel like this this is like crooked. My room's a mess right now because there's like so much stuff I have. Um, and I just like haven't had time to organize it. But basically I want to put a, I want to put something right there. But then when I tried putting that there, it just looked so off because then that was plain. I don't know if it's just because I'm so used to that being there. I don't really know. But it kind of stresses me out that there's like a blank wall there. But I think once I put my new comforter on and a bunch of pillows, it's going to get a lot cozier with like all these like throw pillows or throw blankets i just love the look of it being like all like bushy and cozy and then lastly i'm still trying to figure out my nightstand situation because this is just like not cute whatsoever so i really want to get like an organizer not an organizer like have you guys ever seen those you definitely have it's literally just like a plate like a long like a rectangular plate sometimes it's like a mirror on the bottom or like a, almost like a border around it some people put like their perfumes in it that kind of thing so i feel like it would be cute to like put my candle in there and it's like my hand lotion and chapstick i can put my apple watch this stuff just like has to go but i just can't find a place where I can put it that I'll like remember taking my medication so that is my dilemma right now like I said still trying to figure it out but as soon as I do I will definitely keep you guys updated on that situation but the good thing is with this meeting I think it just might be this first day that they can't see us because it's like a live thing it's not like over zoom or anything um but, like, yeah, they can't even see us. So, it really doesn't matter what we look like. But, I just threw on, like, a nice sweater just in case. Um, but, today's just been, like, non-stop going. So, I haven't really had time to do my makeup. I got, <laughs> I got this ring light for my computer. And it's like the best invention ever. It kind of looks weird on like this camera. But like on video camera it like actually looks like you have a real ring light. I actually do want to get like a real ring light. Because it just like makes like videos look so much better. And like they are expensive but I feel like it's like a really good investment. So... With all that being said, I just rambled for eight minutes straight. I had to get back on the meeting in like five minutes. So I'm going to go pee and I will talk to you guys after my meeting when I can't wait to eat my vegan ice cream for dessert and make my new bed. Making... Some vegan cookies and that's the second batch. Here's the first batch. Literally so gooey and amazing. My parents already had one and I had a half of one because I ate so much dough. <laughs> what are you doing? Hello everybody. Today's a new day. I recorded recorded some clips from a couple of days ago, Friday night. And for whatever reason, they like were on my camera, but they wouldn't play. Like all the footage was like gone. Really confusing and really annoying, but it's okay. I'm just gonna remake this outro. I originally showed my like night nighttime skincare routine but I'll just do that in a whole different video just because it's like really elaborate and this video is already like so long. So with that being said, thank you so much for watching. If you made it all the way through, congratulations. <laughs> it was such a long video. I think this is the longest video I've made, but since it's like my first time back in a really long time, I wanted to make it very elaborate. <laughs> of my week and whatnot so again thank you so much for watching like and subscribe 
if you enjoyed and i'll see you in the next video